All right, here we go. A 2022 Series 1 Mega Box. Picked this up at Wally Worlds a couple days ago. At the end of this video, we will be announcing the winner of the Update Chrome giveaway. And we'll be having a, another giveaway for this video. And no, that giveaway is not going to be any of the cards in this box a bonus giveaway so details on that stay tuned for the end of the video for that and of course stay tuned for the end for one of these cards i'll be giving away we'll be announced the winner at the end so stick around jared kelnick rookie a basically a refractor even though it doesn't say it that tease all-star game purple debut of kelnick aaron judge the hottest hitter with the home run totals currently in the league right now and a Francisco Lindor blue refractor numbered out of 199. So I think there was a lot of you that were looking for the Lindor. So hopefully one of you all can grab that, but let's get to it. Let's see what's in this mega box. I have not opened a mega box, I don't believe this year. And I was like, eh, I'll just grab one. They're a little pricey. So we're gonna fly through this base because we've all seen it. So. I'm not quite sure, are they throwing? I guess we can get the, try to get some of the rookie cards stacked. That way we can kind of get a decent idea. The small little tiny logo rookie cards. We have a, fo a, fo a file, a foil, no longer on that team. Had a rough start prior to this year, but now he's pretty much one of the hottest hitters in American League. Trevor Story and Buster Posey hitting the retirement card there. All right. Yeah, quite a few packs, so we're going to try to rip through this as possible. Hopefully keep this video, oh, I don't know, 10, 15 minutes. That's what I try to keep all of my videos at. Brian Crawford's having a down year. Definitely not like last year. Brandon Marsh, big name there. And we have one of those feet things. <laughs> Flash, flashiest feet. Ernie Clement with a Jazz Chisholm who's having a great year. Along with a Aaron Judge. A lot of those stars of MLB. So hopefully we get like one parallel out of here. <laughs> I don't know. And I think the auto is a long shot. What are, they throw relics in here? I'm not quite sure. It doesn't really say exclusively on the packaging. I don't. I think I kind of breezed it over. It looks like we have maybe, I'm not quite sure what that is coming up. Let's see. It's a blue, oh, it's gonna be the Walmart. Forgot, we got a Walmart blue, Alec Manoa. A good year, year last year. With a Jose Ramirez leading the league and Ribbies. You aren't picking Jose Ramirez cards up. Time would be to do now, because it's kind of been like a rocket ship. He's just taken off and not wanting to land. It's going to be sticking pretty much the rest of his career. It seems like with the newly team chain team changed name of the Guardians. So, but yeah, he's got the most ribbies and his cards are probably decently cheap. I haven't checked recently. Everyone's getting excited because it's a wander on there. Here comes all the team cards. We have an 87 Byron Buxton with a Chris Bryant. Not in that uni either. Yeah, I need to go look at some Jose Ramirez. Kind of a, I, w I don't know if you would consider it a long shot. He just wasn't very on the map in the beginning of his career, but I think arguably we gotta admit that he's probably one of the best third basemen in the league right now. If I mean, arguably the top, I would want to say. Eric Hosmer, Padre is playing my Giants right now, and they're beating us up pretty pretty good. Giants are very streaky this year. Okay, so we got like trifectas. Probably missed a rookie in there. Anyway, Shohei on that stars of MLB. Randy Rosarena with this rookie cup. Devin 
Williams. Broken hand, Devin Williams. And Astros just got our kind of utility player, Marco Dubon. Um, Cody Bellinger, Generation Now, and Mookie Betts on those. Mauricio Dubon, I don't know why. I had Marco in my head because I went to go see the Eugene Emeralds the other day. The high A for the Giants and Marco Luciano is first at bat. Nice Badal Rohan hit a Jack, which is the Giants' number one prospect, Andrew Vaughn. He was having a good year. I'm not. I was going to pick up some of his cards, and they were just pricey. Shocked how expensive some of his autos were already. Yeah, Marco Luciano is looking good. I am looking to grab some of his cards. Patrick Bailey. I did not know he was a switch hitter. But pick the game, home run challenge, Joey Gallo. He didn't look so good. He was DHing. He didn't play in the field. I don't know. He almost looked injured. I'm not quite sure if he is, but his cards are not wanting to stay. It's almost like he had a, a gimp, a limp, gimp, gimp limp. But Marco Luciano, yeah, he's 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 got it going. I don't know about his arm though. His arm didn't seem very wrong but maybe it wasn't necessary for the situational plays I'm not quite sure but Reed Detmers or Angels no hitter and a Nolan Arenado Giants killer on the 87 with a Bo Bichette behind all right See what we're gonna get at this next pile, and then we will get into the giveaway announcements and also last video's giveaway winner. And we have our next blue is gonna be a Wilson Contreras, along with Alex Bregman. Nothing crazy going on in this Mega. A lot of these. I guess every single pack has these inserts. Stars of MLB. Joey Wendell. Yeah, it was fun to get out. I, I live near Spokane. Actually going to be going to my first card show next weekend in Spokane Valley. So excited for that. Probably should be filming, I would assume, as long as they allow it. We do have a backwards card. Should we save it? Or is it a short print? Probably already tail. I don't know the codes for the short prints, but it's there. We'll save it for now. Just to make the the video a little bit more exciting. There's a Wander sighting. I don't know why I put Jared Kelnick over in the rookie card ball. I probably passed so many rookies already. And I'm kind of just flying through the base. This one looks a little bit more centered. A lot of the Francos, although not top and bottom. A lot of the Francos. Yeah, it's it's high. But a lot of the Francos, when I was opening originally, what I'm trying to say, were pushed to the left heavily but there's like a million of those cards either way so it's not really an important card and it is paper which is starting to lose its value it's an interesting tattoo it's like fish gills hmm hmm hmm, hmm. Max Freed Tim Anderson now in the news with Josh Donaldson yesterday won't really get into that, but getting into that'll be an interesting name to watch come the All Star break. Possible trade news on Juan Soto and where his career is going to maybe continue next. I think the Nationals are going to get rid of him because they are tanking and. 
He's a superstar. That's a nice chest protector on Johan Heem. Although I believe they've just put up Sam Huff. Adley Rushman just got his debut yesterday. It's pretty neat to watch it, watch it personally, speaking of the Orioles. Trey Mancini. And there's that Juan Soto. A lot of talk in a couple months on him. Look at this corner. Beautiful. Great corner. Quality. Quality corner there. This pack feels thicker. I don't know. Let's open it up. Let's see why. I don't see anything special there. Buster. Buster Buster. Trevor Rogers. San Diego. And a Kyler Miller. Chris Bryant. With the City Connect. I think that's what they're being all right. City Connect. <laughs> Ivan Castillo. Ooh, we have a numbered card. Out of 76. What is 76? A good name, too. Ooh, it is... What is that? Independence Day? Trevor Story? Pretty sure, right? Or... Fourth of, I, I forget the parallel name. I've never pulled one of these. It's got to be independent. Well, they do 76 probably because 1776 makes sense. I think it's independence. Sweet. And he is rising right now. Cool card. Very cool card. You know what? We will... Very rarely sleeve cards up, but that one deserves probably an immediate sleeve. On film, put him in his own pile. I, I was like, what are those cards over there? <laughs> Let's grab them. That's the waiting game over there. The waiting pile. Sweet. I was like, I've never pulled a like a Mother's Day, Father's Day, Independence Day, any day. Take parallel. Born. That would be my first. And it's of a decent name too, which is actually exciting, I guess. Alec Wells. Eli Morgan. Sorry, these, I just noticed these are a little off. Welcome to the show. Been up here for a while. Good old Vladdy. This thing feels thick too. All right, second to last pack, then we'll get into that. All the, all the greatness here. There's Josh Donaldson. Connor Wong. Sean Manaya, pretty well on us the other day. Luis Gill, rookie. And we're gonna get, nope, that's not a foil. That was another foil, but, wow, only one foil. Shohei, oh, double, oh, so we got a chrome, okay. Shohei, not too bad. It's our only, well, one more pack, but I was gonna say, that's the only chrome. That's the video. Which is kind of surprising. You'd think you'd get more Chrome cards. A Jackson Reitz. Door. Side gray. We're going to get an 87 out of this pack. Miguel. Ashby. Jesse Winker. Pretty good year last year. And Joey Votto. All right, let's get into the mystery pile. So in the back here, it's a Bryce Harper. And a generation now of Andrew Vaughn. Which I was prospecting. Well, not prospect. I guess you can consider that. 
All right, uh, we'll go, it's numbered, okay. So, I don't know what that means. <laughs> At a 4.99, so it's the green. If you wanna call that, call it that, of Luis Guerriel Jr. Is that the green ice? Uh, what do they call this, I forgot. I mean, it's like of an ice, but it's not wave, is it green wave? I'm not quite sure. Every single product and set has its own parallel names. So, out of 4.99, so we hit a couple relatively juicy parallels. I think this Trevor Story one definitely bigger, but just the name. But Ariel Junior is not a bad one either. Anyways, let's get into the fun stuff for this video. So when I was at Walmart picking up this mega box, I seen these, and I know it's Panini, and I know it's nothing special, but they were the last two, and I haven't seen them in a while, and we know how overpriced any Panini product is with Mosaic but this one is frayed. So since that one's frayed, I'm gonna open one and I'm gonna give away this pack. So if you would like this pack of mosaic, got the, I think the red, white, and blue, I'll open one to see what's in it. Comment down below and I'll get that shipped out and I will announce the winner in an upcoming video. Of course, we're gonna get to the winner of last week's there's the bonus pack. Just in a few seconds, but just to give you an idea of what to maybe expect, I was like, oh, I'll open some mosaic. It's been a while. Gossman. And I know it's not licensed, but it's a mosaic, I guess. Sixto Sanchez. A vintage mosaic silver of Eddie Matthews. A silver of Josh Bell. It's not too bad. Edward Olivares. A green of Justin Verlander. And we have a Joey Bart. What happened to his season? Another green mosaic of Duke Snyder. Joey Bart is pretty much the worst hitter in the league. Vintage and debuts. I don't know if that's considered an orange or just team color but nonetheless he is on extreme downward spiral <laughs> yeah i i picked up a few of his cards in hopes that there could be a possibility of him doing something in the league but behind the plate it's not too bad but i think he is hands down the worst in the league Hitting from the right. A lot of Giants here. Well, X-Giant there in the middle. And Ko hey, Arihara. Okay, so they're pink, not red, white, and blue. Sorry if I said red, white, and blue. Comment down below in this video. Chance to win that. I'll pick a winner about a week from now. For that, thank you for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Let's head over to the computer. It's a little bit, went a little bit longer than I expected, but nonetheless, we got through it. Thanks for watching. If you've gotten this far, if you're still sticking around for the giveaway, I will catch you in a few seconds. All right, here's that video of those five cards. So we are going to copy the URL, head over to the random YouTube comment picker. Let's paste that bad boy URL in there. See how many entries we have. Nine lucky possible winners. If you do happen to win, please reach out to me at sportscardfactory at gmail.com. It is also in the description. Just click the email address, sportscardfactory at gmail.com. Let's see the lucky winner. Good luck to everybody. Card Central 101. Not too bad. I would love that, Lindor. Good luck, everyone. Well, good luck is on your side, Card Central 101. Congratulations. You are the winner. Please reach out to me, just like I mentioned, sportscardfactory at gmail.com. I can get your address, just send an email, address, name, 
all that good jazzy stuff and I will get that shipped out to you. And thank you everyone else who entered the giveaway. And if you are participating in that mosaic pack, go ahead and comment below. I will catch y'all in the next video. Thanks for watching.